I'm Emma Davis and I've studied business management. I would line has been a bit of a roller coaster. There are times, you know, that it's been quite stressful. Uh, but the lecturers, my peers, my family and friends have all brought me through that and <laughs> urged me on to the other side. Um, the amount of knowledge that I've learnt through the three years you know you you can't replace that it's phenomenal and I don't think I could have gained that in a position elsewhere um, I came to study through a, a previous job I was a property manager for a private landlord I uh, loved the job I did but knew I had something more to give and I just wanted to get a qualification behind me to justify you know pushing myself forward um, so I gave up that job and came to be a student full-time um, I was 36, single mother, <laughs> um, and I've just loved every second really. It's just been a phenomenal experience and I would just highly recommend it to everybody. I'd like to say I wish I did it earlier, but I'm glad I did it now, really. So yeah, it's full time, and now back to work. <laughs> Louise, our head tutor and the course director, uh, let me know that there was um, a trip for level fives to go and see a company called Western Solar, who build um, solar houses. And she said, as it was part of my dissertation, uh, my subject was uh, photovoltaic energy and homes of the future. She thought it would be really beneficial for me to go. So I went uh, to meet Dr. Glenn Peters, who is the owner of the company. And uh, whilst I was there, I asked if I could interview him for my dissertation. He was obviously happy to, to do that. So I went back dictaphone in hand, question sheet, and was cheeky enough to ask how I would get a job with him at the end. And he offered me a position as project manager for Western Solar. Um, it's going to start off as a temporary basis, just as an internship, see where we go, but we're going to go from there. And we're just about to start construction on 15 houses. So <laughs> in the deep end, but I love it. And if it weren't for being here, I would never have met him, I would have never been cheeky enough to ask him for a job and he's gracious enough to give me the opportunity to work in a sustainable company, building homes for people using solar energy, you know, I, I couldn't think of anything better, that, that is just the dream really.